Okay, everybody. Here's the start of our Meals in a Jar slash Pouch series. Uh, today, I'm going to show you how to make cream of whatever soup. That means you can make all kinds of nice soups. Okay, what you're going to need is you're going to need four cups of milk powder, not powdered milk. And I'll show you in a little bit what I mean. One and a half cups of cornstarch. A half a cup of chicken bouillon granules. Five teaspoons of onion flakes. Three teaspoons of Italian seasoning. One teaspoon of black pepper and one teaspoon of butter powder. Now you don't have to use the butter powder if you don't have it. Whenever you do your cooking process, then you can just add a little bit of butter to that. Okay, so basically what we're gonna do is just combine everything together. I have this number 10 can. What we're gonna do is we're gonna start loading the can. Okay, now we're gonna put in the milk powder cornstarch, chicken granules, butter powder, pepper, onion flakes, and Italian seasoning. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my little lid on the top of it there. And then I'm going to shake it up real good. And as you can see, it's all mixed up. And that's it. Okay, to keep this mixture as fresh as possible, oxygen absorber and a desiccant pack in my can to help it stay fresher and to keep the moisture out. To make the soup, you're going to need one third cup of the mix, one cup of water, put that in a saucepan, whisk it together to get, you know, make sure there's no lumps or what. Put that on your stove. If you wanted to add a meat or a vegetable to this, you would need to add a half a cup to your mixture we just made. You could very well add a little bit more just depending on how much or little that you want in your soup, but this is my recommendation. Okay, I'm going to put a third of a cup of my mixture in there. And my mushrooms. And that's it. And then you just put the oxygen absorber and your desiccant pack in there. Put your lid on, suck the air out. Put your ring on, put that in your pantry. Make sure that you get a label and you label on here what it is, first of all, and then the um, amount of water to mix ratio. Okay, now what I mean by milk powder is this is milk powder, not powdered milk. It has a much better flavor than powdered milk does. It has a little bit thicker consistency. It's just totally different. So milk powder, it's not expensive. You can buy it at Walmart. This is where I got it from. It's where I got most of my stuff from. In my saucepan, I'm gonna put one cup of water. Mixture. And we're gonna mix it all together. Now we're gonna turn our heat on high heat and let it come to a boil. Okay, now it's coming to a boil, so we're going to turn our heat down to low to medium heat. And you can see it's starting to thicken up. We're going to simmer that at really, really low heat. It's done. Um, it was a little bit thicker, so I added a little bit more water to it because it's just so easy to do. Thanks for watching.